Thank you for your interest in Swerkit. Today, we're going to walk you through the steps of screen recording a Swerkit workout that you can then share with your students. Remember, if your students have their own Swerkit accounts, you can simply share the workout and they can access within the app. However, if your students don't have their own accounts, we want to make sure they can work out too. So, let's jump right in and walk through the steps of screen recording your Swerkit workout on a Mac computer. First, you'll need to open QuickTime. Once you open QuickTime, go up to the left-hand corner of your screen and click File. Then, you go down to New Screen Recording and it will open up this little box here with a Record button. Now, what we'll do is we'll open our browser and go to app.swerkit.com. From here, you'll select the workout that you want to record. You can create your own custom workout and record one of those, but for the purpose of this video, we'll go with the workout from our Swerkit Kid workout collection. Let's go with Agility for Kids. I'm going to select the workout, select the timing, 10 minutes. Now we go back to QuickTime and press record. If you just click down on your mouse, you record the entire screen. But if you want to just record the workout screen, you could do so by dragging and holding and selecting the portion of the screen you want shown. Then you hit the start record button. Now your screen is being recorded. Begin your workout and move your mouse out of the display. You want to have this go through the entire workout without touching your screen. This is a great opportunity for you to follow along and work out. Important to note, this will also record the audio, but for the purposes of this video, I have the audio turned off. All right, I'm going to pause this. Once the workout is completed and you're done recording, you want to go down to the QuickTime Player icon at the bottom of your screen and right-click and press Stop Screen Recording. That will save the file for you and it should automatically open up. Now, from here, you can trim the clips. So say the beginning is you're setting it up and you don't really want that to be a part of your final video. You can trim it and maybe the end has you clicking and stopping the recording. So you want to cut that off as well. You can hit trim and now your video is shortened just to show the workout. Once you're done there, you can hit the exit button and it will ask you to save it. So we'll save this as swerkit-kids-agility-10. Save to your documents folder or wherever you like to save it on your computer. Now you have a file that you can send to your classroom or upload it on YouTube to share with your students. We hope this tutorial helps you. For more information about our Swerkit Youth Initiative, please visit www.swerkit.com and click Youth Initiative.